it's time for another Saturday wrap. Another Saturday wrap done on a Friday. Hmm, that's what I do. Anyway, the Saturday wrap for Saturday the 15th of July 2023. And there's a yellow wind warning. And it's going to be rainy. There may even be the odd thunderstorm. Who knew? Anyway, um, one of the things I'm going to talk about this week, Prime. I'm part of Prime Day, which was actually two days. I've got a new webcam. I hope you like it. It comes in closer. Uh, so far, things have been going quite well. Mm, we shall see anyway. So, if anyone hasn't seen this before, this is me looking back at the past week. You know, that was the week that was. Um, tech, beer, media, uh, more tech, more media, um, and weather. So, okay, the word of the week. May not be the biggest word of the week, but for me, kind of was. And that was prime. It was prime day, Tuesday and Wednesday. Actually, that's prime days. Um... And I had some stuff in my basket and I was thinking about it and yeah, actually the price did come down. It came down quite a lot. Um, although, if you're thinking of doing this, uh, I think the next one's Black Friday. Price up everything you want beforehand and see if the prices come down then. Anyway, this Prime Day is for only for people who actually have Prime. And um, it arrived. And it's good. And I'm enjoying it. Um, so that was it. Prime Day. Uh, okay. So this is an Anchor 2K webcam. And the software of the week is Anchorworks. Quite small. Plugged it in. Immediately updated the firmware on the webcam. Allows you to do lots of different things as well. Um, autofocus, white balance, uh, flickering, 60 or uh, 50 hertz, all that sort of thing. Looks great on the Mac. On the Dell, it's tiny. You can hardly read any of the stuff. It works, don't get me wrong, but it's tiny. I'm going to have to contact them. Anyway, um, so um, let's have a look. Anchor Power Conf C200. I like it. It's got its own microphone as well. And the microphone seems to work well. Ah, right. The thing of the week, and you've probably guessed it, and we are having issues with the media. Mainstream media, social media, um, people... Anyway, you probably guessed, and I'm not going to mention the name because I don't have to, because it was floating around on WhatsApp, uh, Sunday stroke Monday. Uh, Twitter had it, Reddit had it. Um, and of course, when anyone gets caught out and such like, they have mental health problems. Yeah. It's a mess for everyone involved, and I'm going to keep out of it. But there you go. Anyway, look back on the past week. Uh, just after I recorded this last week, you know, my new credit card, and I had four months of Apple TV Plus. Well, I went back and started to watch For All Mankind from the beginning, which Apple's interface wasn't that easy. It wanted to carry on where I'd finished, which was on the current series. Um, Eventually, I worked out how to get back to the beginning. And, well, the first time I watched it, it was free. And it was Easter 2020, um, the Easter weekend. And I binge watched it. A lot of memories for me because Easter Monday, we lost Big Tone. And I was watching For All Mankind up to that. Um, it is really, really good. Um, not a breaker of secrets or anything like that it's an alternative history where the russians get to the moon first really really worth watching and i think you can possibly see it for free anyway the first series if you've got the apple tv plus app which is practically on everything nowadays uh, and just have a little look if not uh, have a look on youtube might be there 
Anyway, Saturday morning. Saturday morning, rainy morning. In Bedworth, we had two Christmas trees that were planted and left in. Uh, the one on the park, which is coming along quite nicely, and the one by the council offices, which is not quite huge, but getting there. And I just thought to myself, the nights are slowly drawing in, and it'll soon be Christmas. I did ping them out on various pieces of social media and got heavily criticised for which I can't blame the people to be honest at all. There you go. Um, went into Newport obviously. There were beers involved. Chips have gone up 30p in the Harbour Fish Bar. Yeah, everything's going up. Anyway, little tap house. Tap room? Tapper? I can never remember. That was good. That was very good, to be honest. And they had some Belgian beers newly in. Sunday, Sunday was planting things. Well, planting things out. Seven tomato plants and four cucumber plants are now outside. And what with the weather this week, there has been very, very little need for me to go out with a watering can. Which I can live with, to be perfectly honest. I've seen that a lot. Um, they're growing well. Um, the first Crimson Crush, uh, that's going to go red before long, and I'm going to have to remember to keep the thing well fed uh, and pinch out the little side runners because uh, we don't want any more of those. Um, right, on to Monday. Uh, there was a security update, one of those little ones, 2.8 megabytes. Uh, it was on and then it was withdrawn. And then on Wednesday, it was back in, and it's now on. Basically, uh, there was a problem with WebKit, which is the rendering engine in Safari, the browser, and it was causing problems with Reddit and Facebook and various other social media things. Uh, Apple, just like Microsoft, need a little bit more testing, even if it is a zero day. A stitch in time saves nine, possibly. Who knows? Um, Tuesday, ordered the Prime stuff. Um, and also, I was supposed to get my new car mat. Uh, it didn't arrive. It was supposed to come at eight o'clock in the night. I think that was just a holding time. Definitely didn't arrive. Had a look on Wednesday morning. Apparently something to do with the postal strikes. Hmm, not sure about that. They said, give it until Thursday. Um, it did arrive on Thursday. And it had that new car mat rubber smell. <laughs> um, tested the webcam on Thursday as well. Um, fitted the car mat this morning. When I say fitted, took the old one out, stuck it in the bin. Um, and put the new one in. It does have a nice new car mat smell. Really does. Um, I like it a lot. Um, okay, I only need one because I could pass just to be perfectly honest. Did it again? Sorry, anyway, lunchtime today in the tumble. Ooh, what's that? Oh, there's a leak. There's a leak. So there was a bollard saying, Wet floor, be careful, and on top of that, an ice bucket catching the drips. Could have been rain stop playing, but I had to go back to work. Anyway, um, it is a rather truncated Saturday wrap. But this week has been sort of, it's just gone. And there was the media thing, and then there was Prime, and lots of weather. So, um, thank you very much. Usual comments, um, and I will see you next week, no doubt. Bye-bye.